This educational video is prepared for promoting active learning for crystallography engineering. What is sample preparation? Sample preparation is a process to prepare a proper sample in order to get a high-quality XRD data. There are three conditions that need to achieve in order to have good XRD data. Firstly, total randomness of crystallite orientations. Secondly, sufficient number of crystallites to get a representative intensity distribution for the sample and lastly sufficient diffraction intensity to meet satisfied counting statistics. This is an example of a well-ground and underground sample. So, how do we know the samples are well-ground or underground? For well-ground samples, it has a particle size of at most 44 microns. Besides it would resemble a flower such that when we rub the sample between fingers, we would not be able to feel the individual grains. On the other hand, for underground samples we would be able to distinguish individual grain not only by feel but sight as well. For well-ground sample, all plane sets are detected by XRD machine. Thus it has sufficient crystallites to obtain accurate intensity ratios and to obtain a good signal. For underground sample, the plane sets are not fully detected. Thus it has insufficient crystallites to obtain accurate intensity ratios. In conclusion, it is vital to grind our samples into well-ground sample as it influences the diffraction pattern we will receive and give difficulties to identify, characterize, and interpret our sample. Next. What is preferred orientation? The preferred orientation is defined as a bias of orientations of one or more specific crystallographic planes. What are the cause of preferred orientation? The cause of preferred orientation are crystallites are not all randomly orientated and the mounting samples on a flat plane which will cause preferred orientation due to the flattening process. What are the disadvantages of preferred orientation? The disadvantages are the intensity variations in XRD powder experiments, insufficient intensity in some of the reflection rays and lastly the results obtained are highly skewed. How to reduce the effects of preferred orientations? To reduce the effects, we need to be consistent in the sample mounting and packaging techniques by maintaining steady pressure. Next, is use acetone-based slurry mounting and lastly the material's particle size should be decreased to between 5 and 10 micrometers. Types of grinding. Firstly is hand grinding. The powdered XRD samples are prepared by using pestle and mortar. The samples are ground under a liquid medium such as methanol to minimize sample loss and mitigate structural damage to the phase of samples during grinding. Secondly, is mechanical grinding. It is able to grind a sample to 1 micrometer. The ethanol acts as liquid medium to reduce the lattice strain during milling. It consists of a Teflon cup holding pallets and only small amount of samples can be processed. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.